Hello everyone, welcome to TechEQA channel. In this video, we are going to see how to hack Android Apps database. So, every mobile application will have a local database in Android mobile devices. So, if you are working on the offline, it will save your data in offline, like in local database, then it will push to the server, maybe the remote database. So, we can hack the local database as well, and we can do some modification, and again, we can push to the same place so it will affect our app for example our username is uh, for example techieqa we can add the database we can change the username techieqa to something else if we push to the device the username will be changed but it won't affect the server but in local we can change it so i will for this purpose i am using emulator if you are using real device that uh, device should be rooted device so for that purpose, I'm using emulator only and uh, the local database is SQLite database. Once you like, uh, once you hack the database, you need to view the data. For that purpose, we need a browser for SQLite. I think from here you can download for Windows, Linux, sorry, Windex, uh, Windows 6432 and uh, Mac also. Okay. Now I'm going to hack uh, gmail gmail database for that purpose what you have to do go to command prompt adb devices devices connected is there adb shell once you do adb shell it will navigate to some other uh, like place root generic like this it won't locate it in your uh, os actually it will be changed to linux linux based os so all the linux based command will work here if you do ls you can see all the things so here what you have to do go to cd data slash data enter so once you enter into that place do ls you can see lot of package package names for each app will have package so all the data of each app will stored under data slash data for, for gmail here is the package name com.google.android.gm okay the last command is just i went to data data inside data i choose this package again do cd package name okay i entered into the gmail package name do ls here you can see app ssl catch catch file code catch databases files and shared preference so databases if you are working with real device you cannot enter uh, like next data sometime okay we need router device if it is real that's why we choose emulator so this is actually for a demo purpose how you can act so just open the database folder ls yeah here i have i have uh, logged in with uh, some sample gmail make make me apps gmail.com db internal internal will have a like table details of what uh, whatever the gmail required the mail store so here is the mail store db which will have all the data okay open one more tab in terminal we will go to desktop what i have to do i found where the db is located okay pwd will will show you the location copy this location go to this next tab adb pull that uh, location with database name which database you want to hack i want to hack mail store if you are logged in with some other mail you can see that mail also here the database name i have given just enter okay so 7.2 mb per second actually yeah it's uh, already in my desktop i can see it here mail store so now how can you view this file that is the question for that purpose only we need a db browser for sql Lite. you have to download and install it so already i have downloaded so let me open it Once you open, click on open database. 
the last file you have downloaded right it's on desktop so once you open you can see all the table table and table description here because this is database structure right so you can see all the table what are the table inside this database get what there are 25 tables okay and 20 indices triggers are 8 delete message label insert message instant message labels there are a lot but i want to see the data from the table actually click on browse data i have choose we have to choose the table here adds nothing android metadata only the uh, language is language is there attachment there is nothing so like that conversation okay so in conversation you can see the last mail whatever okay security alert this is a subject actually okay this all subject you can see here subject and the message if you have any attachment that also you can okay so yeah subject only there is some image kind of thing okay and conversation go to uh, messages the messages whatever coming message also you can see so all the table uh, whatever the data you, you you are seeing in gmail everything will be there in the database as well okay so this is how we can hack the database and uh, we can modify maybe we can modify something and we can push it to gmail again let's try try from your side how to hack the database once you get to know maybe in next video we can see how to change uh, some subject and again push to the device itself okay thanks for watching guys please subscribe our channel for more videos like this if you have any doubt please put into comments thank you